Investigators are studying this video looking for 10 people in the crowd who stomped and kicked a defenseless 16 year old boy Easter Sunday on 12th Street, right outside Coney Island's Luna Park. The victim suffered a punctured lung as the crowd watched and jeered. He wasn't the only person injured in an attack near Coney Island's Boardwalk. About one hour after this brutal beatdown, this 27 year old woman was hit in the head with a bottle. Loud noises during that altercation, mistaken for gunfire. After the bottle was thrown in the air and she was hit with the bottle, like two seconds later we heard about four or five shots. You heard shots? Yes, right here by the cyclone and we seen a whole group run towards the boardwalk. The family's looking to take in the beautiful weather and fun activities ran for cover. People were locked in, they were trying to get out, they climbed, they were climbing the fences. Police investigated and tried to calm the crowds, even taking to Twitter, writing, all reports of any shooting by the amusement area in Coney Island are are false. There were no shots fired or anyone shot. By that time, the fun on the boards was ruined. Customers either scared away or turned away as Luna Park closed early. All the rides are closed. There's nothing to do. We bought tickets for nothing. Police don't believe the two assault incidents are related and no arrests have been made in either case. As Luna Park reopens this weekend, the 60th Precinct will be providing more police patrols in this area now and throughout the rest of the summer. In Coney Island, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News.